The Eagletronics robotics team at Alishaw Elementary has been hard at work preparing to showcase their newest invention, an alert to save wolves, to the first LEGO League. The yearly challenge has three facets. The robotic challenge, in which a team-built robot has to compete in an obstacle course. The core values portion, which tests the students' teamwork and solution-finding skills while they respectfully attempt to complete the robotics challenge course and a final project. Santa Maria Times education reporter Krista Chandler stopped by fifth grade teacher and robotics team advisor Valerie Trenev's class to find out how things are going. Um, Nicholas, if you could run the rag box, which is called the radio activated guard box for our visitors, then they can kind of see what we're doing with the wolf project. And that's a huge part of what we're doing. Um, Lego has them do three things to compete. One of them is the robot playing field, which you see here where um, this robot is going to be here in the base. Kyle, you want to pick it up? And the robot is going to go through these challenges. Okay. And then the second thing that the robot, or the second part of our whole experience is every year there's a theme, and this year is animal allies, and that means you have to come up with a program or a project that helped the relationship between animals and people. And our, our focus was wolves. And so we're, our, our invention, which Nicholas will show you in a few minutes, is a way to scare away wolves. Kyle's our lead programmer. He did a lot of work with the robot. Um, so we have building going on. We have design um, you know, involved in the building of the robot because it needs to be able to pull, push, grab. And if you have to look at the challenges and kind of work backwards and say, OK, this is what I have to do in order to achieve that challenge. So each year, the theme is um, important because the challenges are sort of specific to that. So like in this challenge behind me, which is Animal Allies, they're moving animals around. They're having to transport the, uh, what is that thing, the shark? Yeah, shark. Sure. They have to transport the shark. How did you decide upon this project? Like what in particular sparked everybody's interest about the wolves in general? Uh, well, we were just over there um, brainstorming, like what could we do, what could we do? And someone suggested, hey, wolves, and we were like, okay, yeah, that sounds pretty good, but what about wolves? And then the idea kind of just exploded. The Eagletronics team has been meeting every Wednesday at lunch and after school on Fridays, as well as collaborating with a robotics team in New Mexico to complete their project to save wolves in and around Yellowstone National Park. Well, we made the rack box, so it's kind of like a guard system mm -hmm. around the ranch because the the ranchers keep on shooting the wolves because they're trying to eat the, their cattle because the ranchers scared away the, all the deer and natural animals with, when they moved the cattle because it got rid of m part of the forest and it scared the deer away so now all the wolves have to eat is the cattle. Ranchers will really benefit from our invention because it will detect the wolves with this thermal imaging and then what it'll do is set off an alarm and a strobe light and it causes the wolves to get afraid and run away and they're really smart. They, they will become habituated to certain sounds and uh, movements or whatever and so chasing them off has become a really big business. We, tr we kind of struggle with that question, what if a deer walks by or something, but the way we figured if there was other predators, like a mountain lion or a bear, you don't want them around your livestock either. Oh, and if it's some sort of animal that is going to be eaten by a predator, we don't want them there either because they're bait. So it kind of worked out that just any large, warm-blooded thing that's an uh, animal that's uh, emitting heat, we don't want it there. We want to just leave the ranchers' properties alone so that they can raise their cattle in peace. And a lot of these cattle are free range. You know, they don't have a fence. It's expensive yeah. to build fences. And it's like coming on to your um, statement about like the wolves getting like used to the noise. Um, we plan to instrument an algorithm into the box that switches different sounds, different yeah. voices, so that the it will never be a stale thing that the wolves can get used to. Yeah, so we were experimenting with like Metallica, heavy metal music. Uh, we also had, I think in there right now is someone screaming, get away, get away. Um, we also had, we were thinking about putting on like talk radio, <laughs> which sounds funny, but you know, just we want a variety of sounds to chase away the wolf. What is the goal of your robotics team in general? Um, in general, our goal would be uh, teamwork, exposure to engineering principles, and 
Do you experience success in working for as a team? Oh yeah, that's it. We will for a long time.